How to create a Facebook pixel event based on button click. That's a good one. Want to track button clicks as pixel events? Here's how. Use the pixel event setup too to create a initiate checkout event when someone clicks a payment form button. You can even set others. And why would you do that? Because sometimes you're using a platform that doesn't track the checkouts, but you have a website tracking it things, right? So you're going to set up the checkout on the button, or you can even set another event if encompasses your reality, okay? And with that, you get more detailed reporting, you can track clicks, form opens and purchases, better remarketing, I can retarget those who initiate checkout but didn't complete it, okay? If you're using Shopify or WooCommerce, you don't need to do this. Those platforms fire initiate checkout automatically. Unless you want to track the button, then you can set up as a view content and something else. And that will help you to see the button clicks to actual initiate checkouts, okay? But let me cast a spell on you right now. Boom! This spell says the following. Those who do not subscribe to this channel would never reach a Rosa Verto.